What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. B from Backyard Barbecue. Hmm, what we gonna cook today? Uh, talk about quick meals, right? I think I put my first one out there, part one of a series. I think I do maybe 10, 15 videos or whatnot. But anyway, uh, today, we're gonna do a quick meal, man. About the five old Bessie right here. And, uh, Bessie. Hey, that's a good name for the grill. Five Bessie right here. We're gonna get it started, man. If you didn't know, this is a Weber. Uh, Char griller, uh, Weber kettle. Sorry about that. Kettle grill, or uh, whatnot. But we're gonna. I use it a lot, just cause I don't feel like pulling out Big Bertha, which is my Shirley Fab. Um, quick meals. Like I said, what we gonna do today? I'm cleaning out my freezer, cause it's about to be the summer. You see, I got short sleeves, shorts on, down in Florida. It's hot. Got my fan on in the garage. TV going. About to watch the TV while I cook. That's the beauty of smoking. Um, oh, let me, on that note, give you a fun fact, right? Some of you that already uh, uh, know who I am, already know I mentioned this, but for the new people that are on the channel, congratulations on being part of something uh, uh, bigger than myself. It's called the barbecue community, y'all. But uh, no, we're going to talk about smoking, the difference between smoking and grilling, right? The difference between smoking and grilling. Grilling is when you take charcoal and just cover the bottom of your grill. Uh, some people just dash with lighter fluid, whatever you, whatever you use. Some people use a chimney, whatever, and you put your meat right on top of the fire. That's grilling. Smoking meat is when you take that same charcoal, put it on the side of your grill. Maybe one half of the grill is charcoal, one third, whatever you, you do. And you put your meat on the other side and you let the vection of it, I mean by that is, like with this Weber, if I put my charcoal on this side, the heat will come up because it's a round top and go around and cook the top, cook the, the meat that's on the top of the grate. So it's not burning. I can sit it there for two, three hours and it won't burn up. It may turn dark if I'm pumping uh, wood to it, but it won't burn up, man. Beautiful for cooking chicken. Smoked chicken is awesome. Um, at the end of the day, I prefer to smoke because I'm lazy and I don't want to stand over the grill all day flipping burgers, especially if you got a lot of people coming to your house and you 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 not only cooking, but you got to entertain. So the beauty of that is you set it and forget it and do your thing, man. Many products out there that work, I just talk about the ones that I have. So, I uh, thought out some chicken, some leg thighs, leg thighs, leg quarters. Uh, my daughter says she's coming over. One of my daughters says she's coming over. She wants some chicken. So I said, hey, I got a pack, because I bought a case and only cooked half of the case in one of my other videos for work. So I pulled out a bag of 10 that's already been counted out. Uh, I got to clean them up. Well, I, I've already cleaned them up and seasoned them. Uh, I'll show you that. Not the process, because uh, this is about quick meals. Season it with, with what you like. And uh, I think I took out some chicken breast. So we're going to go on in the kitchen right and I'm going to show you what it looked like. And then we're going to come on back out here and um, get to it, y'all. Easy day, quick meal. Less than two hours, man. Less than two hours. If you know how to cook, less than about an hour. But I ain't here to brag about that or boast about that. Like I said, quick meal less than two hours. Be back. Let's roll in this kitchen, y'all. We in the kitchen. Uh, talking about quick meals. Chicken breast. As you can see, I lift one arm up for you. Chicken breast. Uh, we got leg quarters here. Leg quarters for my daughter. She's coming over. She loves chicken. She texted me uh, about one in the morning, telling me she want chicken. So I said, okay. That was about two days ago. So I had to take the chicken out, thaw it out, season it up. Um, like I said, it don't take maybe an hour, hour, two hours at the most. And wifey says she want burgers. This is what she like. Um, I don't really eat them, but it's gotta be good because it's black Angus burger. Anyway, like I said, I'm gonna show you how I season these on the grill. No need to put season on there until they go on the grill. I'm going to show you why when we get out there. So without further ado, I'm going to go fire up this grill. Chicken's already been seasoning. It's soaking in, if you want to call it marinating. I don't call it marinating because what I think marinade is, is when you pour a sauce on there, put them in a plastic bag or something. You can shake it up all night, whatnot, and then it sits overnight. But seasoning, I don't know. I don't know the name they call it or whatnot, but I don't call that marinating because it's not a liquid to me. Matter of fact, let me give you an example of marinade. 
See this? This is Laurie's, I guess this herb and white wine. Let's see if you can get a close up with that. See what it says right here? Marinade. 30 minute marinade. Now, if you believe, hold on, let me see if you see it. If you believe that, believe that you can marinate something for 30 minutes, then what I'll do, buy you some of this. But there is no way that you can marinate meat in 30 minutes. Um, at a minimum, four hours, man. A minimum, because meat is tough. The fiber, especially on the strands of chicken and steak, it takes a while for it to get into the meat. All right, like I said, a minimum of four hours. So if you fall for that, that's on you. I'm just here to tell you what I use. Anyway, we're going to go out to this grill, fire it up. See you in a minute. What's up, y'all? It's your boy. We back, Mr. B. It's time to put this chicken on, y'all. Quick meals, like I said. Go ahead and set the timer. Let's get this thing started. Remember, skin down. All right, because if you grill too hot, the first thing you wanted to do is burn your skin and not your meat, All right? Real quick and easy. Got about 10 pieces. Got a couple breasts going on. Yep, time to slide this over. Give it some more room. Real easy to do, y'all. Y'all get the picture. I'm gonna stick them on there and then I'm gonna come back and readjust them. How I like them, but I'm just showing y'all how, how I stick them around the grill and how they do what they do. So right now, since I'm running out of room, actually I'm gonna make room for my breast. Then what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna stick the chicken on top and then come back after a small amount of time. Once they start, all uh, the breasts are done, then I'll move them out and space them out. And then we'll come back and put these on now. Like I said, these are, uh, what are these? Sam's Choice Black Angus Beef Burgers. Leftovers, like I said. See, they're in a plastic bag, it's only four. So I go ahead and put this top on. Let them do their thing, then come back and put them, them burgers on, and then uh, my day is done. About to watch this game, y'all. Be back in a little bit. What's up, everybody? It's about that time. It's been about mm, 40 minutes since I put this chicken on. It's time to flip it. Let's see what we got going on. Woo Let me give y'all a close up of this, man. Show y'all your boy don't play. Yes, sir. Uh, it's a little slow and sear getting busy. Hey, slow and sear. Why don't you send me a pan so my grease stop dropping in here and I can do a review on it. Uh, all right. All I'm doing is flipping my chicken over. Currently right now, I'm trying to get these breasts done so I can have more room for my chicken. But what I'm gonna do is move my chicken around and put the, the, the pieces that were on, on the, the bottom on top. We're gonna keep this going, man. This chicken looks amazing. Beauty of this is you don't see no not one burnt piece of chicken on here, do you? That's called skills, my man. Skills. Skills. But if you watch these videos, and you do exactly as I do, you'll be there too. Obviously using your own season. That's the beauty of this. Barbecue, coming up with your own seasoning. And making people say, dang! This boy can get out a little bit. Puts a smile on my face when I hear that. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna keep it moving. Keep this chicken uh, cooking. And that's pretty much it. We'll be back in a little bit, man, when this chicken's done. All right, YouTube, about that time. Got my tray because I got a good feeling about this. Let's see here. Oh, let's see here. What this tent looking like? Give y'all a close up. Uh, I'll show y'all how this thermopin works. 169. Uh, 190. 87. Breath. 169. 167. Time to pull that. That breast ain't done yet. So it look like one piece of meat ain't done. 
Remember, this is instantaneous here. This breast right here. All right. That's it, y'all. Real easy. Thermopins. They work. They're champ. And I highly recommend them. Uh, I'll take it to the kitchen and then show y'all a piece of it in a minute. All right, y'all. It's that time to put these burgers on real quick. Like I said, this don't take but a quick sec. Put them on. Show you what I do with the seasoning. Right after that. Easy day. You gotta just fall apart. I like this. That's probably one good thing about these these burgers. Put them close to the heat. And then show you my seasoning. You know I love this gourmet till I run out. Nature seasoning. So what you do is pop my top and I season them now. Don't take that much. And what this is gonna do is talk about it after I close the lid. What it's gonna do is it's gonna cook into the meat. Yeah, it's gonna cook into the meat, and then uh, as it actually uh, stops being frozen, as it thaws out and the heat uh, cooks it, it's cooking thoroughly. The actual seasoning will start to seep into the meat. Try it one time and tell me what you think, man. It's a whole lot better than just taking a burger that's already thawed out, putting it on the grill uh, with seasoning already mixed up in it, man. Trust me, you'll thank me for this one. Quick and easy meal, y'all. We'll be back when it's done. All right, y'all. One last look at these burgers. Mm, perfect. Look how good and soft they are. Get a good look. All right, we'll take them in the house with this chicken and then show y'all the final product. We're in the kitchen. Final product. These burgers, look at the seasoning on them. Mmm. -hmm. Chicken. Absolutely gorgeous. Yep, all for my daughter. It's all good. I so, thought that was for me. Man. <laughs> I don't know if y'all heard my wife tripping over there. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, this your boy, Mr. B from Backyard Barbecue, getting harassed by the, the family. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Holla at your boy.